All right, we're here at Guam International Airport. Guam was hit by a super typhoon May 24th. I personally did not have power and water for about 21 days. It is now June 27th and we've had power and water, I say a little over a week and a half. Um, but the person filming me actually right now is my brother. He hasn't been off island in about 17 years and it'll be his first time to Tokyo. I'm gonna see if I can do any camera related stuff. I actually have my Sony A92 with me in this box. I'm gonna see if I can trade it in for maybe a Sony A1 if they have the English version or maybe a um, different brand of camera. And there's a possibility that we may do a shoot there. All right, let's go. How are you feeling right now? How are you feeling? Here we are in Narita International Airport, Japan. This is my brother's first time using the Suica card on his phone to get a drink. And here's the Narita Express coming in. It is actually a first time using Narita Express train. I usually use the bus to get into Tokyo or Yokohama. We have made it to our hotel in Yokohama, the Yokohama Bay Hotel Tokyo. And as you can see, there's Tomo on the side. This hotel has a very nice view and is actually the same hotel that me and Bert stayed at earlier this year in April. And as you can see on the first one, it is 7.02 p.m. and it is time for dinner. And this is our good friend and buddy, uh, Tomo. We all went out to eat some good sushi. The yen rate is very week right now compared to the US dollar so a lot of sushi was around one or two dollars each and it is actually my brother's first time of course first time in Japan so first time trying sushi in Japan super good very very tasty I can't wait to go back and eat there again here we are in the middle of eating at the end of our dinner we had a whole stack of sushi plates here I am at Yodobashi trying out the Sony A1 
I was very impressed by its autofocusing capabilities and a super nice EVF. Sally, all Sony sold in Japan has the Japanese menu. And yeah, 50 megapixels, super nice. Here I am showing the main Sony in Japanese. So all brand new Sony's again have the Japanese menu. And if I were to get a Sony A1 in English, I would have to get it used. And the version would have to be international. But from what I heard, Sony and Ginza actually sells the international English version. Hey Jocelyn. Man, sorry it's raining and your hair is getting wet and... Huh? Another rainy shoot. Yeah, I know. Yeah. And it was clear earlier today. It was good. Yeah, I yeah. think this week is gonna be all rainy. I never been here. It's my first time. Yeah, me too. Tomo? I know it's the first time meeting Tomo. silent shutter so you don't hear you won't hear click 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 it's just like it's taking a photo I'll, I'll tell you oh my god my niece okay one two three can you look over to your left side very good one two and three okay on three one two and three very good, you can put it down. Oh, right in the middle. Yeah, so we're gonna get blur in the front, blur in the back. again oh. with Jocelyn when I came back to Guam um, after the April trip uh, in um, Japan with Bert uh, came back and then Guam is hit by a super typhoon yeah. May 24th and I didn't have any power or water for about three weeks so I couldn't get any content out and uh, power came back on and it was a last-minute planned trip uh, my brother, who I mentioned in the beginning um, of this episode, uh, it was his first time to Japan, so he was filming me at the airport. And here we are, and it's his first time experiencing Japan. So last minute, I asked Jocelyn if she can help me out again on this photo shoot. Hello. Again, thank you so much for help, helping me out last minute. No, thank you. Oh, you're welcome. <laughs> and I did not take the Phase 1 with me. In last video, I shot you with the Phase 1 in yeah. Harajuku. I took the Sony A9 Mark II with the best portrait lens, in my opinion, the 50mm 1.2 G Master lens. I actually just went today to Map Camera to see if I can trade this into mm. for the Sony A1, Sony's mm. flagship camera. But in Japan, Sony menus are only in English. Mm. And they didn't have any international version in stock. And I was going to go for the Canon R5 but it was going to be a two hour wait. And I said to myself, you know what, maybe it's a sign I just stick with Sony. And then maybe when I go back home, think about upgrading from the US to the Sony A1. We've got some shots in, and the main purpose of this video is just to talk about the 50 millimeter 1.2 for travel. And I think this is a very good travel lens. If we take off the hood, I don't know if I could even take this off because it's getting kind of windy. It's not a big lens. Mm. I think it's okay for travel. Yes and it blurs the background really good, especially when the lights are gonna come on soon because the sun's going down. We're gonna get, we're gonna get some good bokeh. How are you feeling? You're okay? I'm very hot. Yes. Japanese summer is very, very hot. Compared to April when you were freezing in Harajuku? I know, it's like, yeah. it's always too extreme. Like in Harajuku, I was freezing, I was yeah. shaking. And here now I'm like sweating. And yeah, I'm sweating too. With the, ooh, so hot. 
Yeah. Yes. Totally different. And what's similar though, it's raining. In yeah. Harajuku is raining. Always and now raining. Doing a shoot <laughs> is raining. Uh, but Jocelyn, your Instagram, if anyone yes. wants to follow you or mm. if they come to Tokyo, if they want to hire you for um, yes. some I, portraits. Yes, I do have two Instagrams uh, for portraits. It's jostika.model and my personal Instagram is jostika7. Awesome. All right, we'll keep on shooting. Let's go. One, two, three. Turn your shoulders a little bit more to the camera. One, two, three. Nice. Okay, so the lines just turned on, as you can see here. Underneath the bridge, very nice and beautiful here. We are moving, Josh is here carrying all the stuff. Thank you so much. Thank you so much. <laughs> this is our last shoot location here with all the lights. And Tomo showed us this bridge with the lights underneath. And yeah, we're gonna shoot here and then we're gonna end it. Get a little closer, so half body. Can I change? Yes. Yeah. Shoulders towards me. Good. Very nice. One, two, three. You can look down like you're thinking about life. You don't know what to do yet. You just quit your job. You don't know what to This is a quick photo shoot. I didn't want to make it too long because it's actually, even though it's um, getting dark, it's still kind of hot a little bit, mm. but I'm so happy that all the lights turned on. I think, well, because I'm thinking about the 135 millimeter uh, 1.8 uh, Sony lens, but for travel, I really like the 50 millimeter 1.2. It's not that heavy. It's small, really good bokeh for the blurred lights here in the background because sun, the sun has set already and it is also very sharp wide open i think it's a good travel lens yeah what do you think about the photos so far um for this photo shoot they look really really good i like them the lightning the bouquet in the background too the blurriness is smooth yeah i like they it look like um, how can i say like the blacks don't look too black you know what i mean like mm -hmm. uh I don't know, I'm not yeah. sure how to describe it. There's some contrast in there. Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah, yeah, yeah. Some details still in the darker yeah, yeah, yeah. areas. Yeah, nice. Yeah, again, nice. your Instagram, uh, just so again, if, it, if you come to Tokyo, you can hire Jocelyn to um, model for you. Hire me. My modeling Instagram is jostika.model and jostika7 for my personal Instagram. I, I'm always uploading funny videos and live in Japan stuff. Yeah, I like your shorts too. Thank you. Yeah, your short videos are pretty <laughs> Thank good. Yeah. Thank you everyone for watching Guam Photography. If you haven't, please subscribe. Bye. Bye, subscribe.